So right off the bat, using a VPN to access Polymarket can work in some cases, but it's not guaranteed due to some restrictions and technical challenges. Since Polymarket is a prediction market platform, it restricts access for users in certain regions like the United States to comply with their regulatory requirements. A VPN, though, can help bypass these geo restrictions by masking your IP address and making it appear as though you're accessing the site from a permitted country. For example, locations in Europe or Asia may grant access. I looked into several sources, including Reddit and YouTube, as well as all of our testing over here to confirm that VPNs like NordVPN or Express have been used successfully to access Polymarket by routing traffic through non-restricted regions. Now, some users have noted that Polymarket is getting better and better at detecting and blocking VPN traffic, making VPN servers basically ineffective regardless of the country selected. It might give you an error page like a 404 or blocked access or something, but a possible solution is to try a different VPN providers or servers because some offer advanced obfuscation features that better disguise the fact that you're using a VPN and switching to a less commonly used server might help. Also, clearing browser cookies or using incognito mode can prevent detection based on the cache data. So you may have heard that you can try to get to Polymarket via unofficial third party websites. But attempting to do so without a good VPN will leave you vulnerable to security risks like phishing or data theft or malware. So that's really not recommended. If you're in a restricted region, the safest approach is to use a reputable VPN to connect directly to Polymarket's official site. So that ensures you comply with the platform's terms of service because using a VPN to bypass restrictions may violate those too. So just make sure to verify that the website is authentic and just consider any legal implications if there would be any wherever you live. So which VPNs are at the top of my list? Starting with NordVPN, it works due to its extensive server network with over 7,600 servers in 118 countries, its obfuscation technology, and its high-speed connection. So its obfuscated servers are designed to hide VPN usage, making it harder for Polymarket to detect and then block that traffic. Nord's reliability in bypassing geo restrictions is supported by a lot of users out there. So it's a go-to for Polymarket. You can install Nord on your device, pretty much any device and operating system, by the way. Just select a server in a country where Polymarket is accessible, such as the UK or Canada. You can enable the obfuscated servers feature in the settings to mask your VPN traffic here. Clear your browser cookies or use incognito mode and then visit polymarket.com. So we can test the connection and if it fails, we can just try a different server in another permitted region. Now, ExpressVPN is another one that a lot of people like for its clean, effective UX design, including me. Uh, It's fast speeds and it's 3000 servers in 105 countries. So that's still plenty of options for connecting to polymarket friendly regions. They've got the lightweight protocol to boost the speed and security, which makes it less likely you'll get detected by polymarkets anti VPN measures. Express is also really consistent at accessing polymarket. It just has less bells and whistles than Nord, but overall it's a really strong VPN. To use it, it's the same thing. So you just download and install Express on your device, choose a server in a non-restricted country such as Germany or Australia, you activate the VPN, you can clear your browser data to avoid location tracking and go to polymarket.com. Again, if access is blocked, just switch to another server or you can contact their support to get a recommendation for a specific server. Now, Surfshark is also a highly effective VPN for accessing Polymarket because it's got enough servers, it's super affordable, and it has several features tailored for bypassing geo restrictions. It's got this thing called camouflage mode, which disguises VPN traffic as regular internet traffic, making it harder to be detected and block, aka the obfuscated servers necessary. It's no borders feature is designed to work in restrictive environments by enhancing access to platforms like Polymarket in regions with especially heavy internet censorship and Surfshark's unlimited simultaneous device connections make it a really practical choice for users who have a lot of devices. I don't think it's got the same oomph as in speed like Nord or Express, but it definitely has what you need for keeping virtual eyes off of you. To use it, it's the exact same thing as the other two, but just in case you're still having trouble accessing Polymarket, make sure to enable the camouflage mode and no borders mode before you try connecting. Now, if you're still having issues, try the following. If you're on a commonly used server like 
meaning you've clicked on one where many people may potentially be using Polymarket, like the UK, for example, you may get detected and blocked. Try switching to a less congested server or enabling any obfuscating features or specialty service that any of these VPNs provide. If you still have no luck, try a dedicated IP option that even Express now provides, which they didn't before, and that might help. The dedicated IP might cost a little extra as an add-on though, so just be aware of that. You should also be aware that using a VPN to access Polymarket from a restricted region might violate local laws or Polymarket's terms, which means your account could be suspended or there could be legal consequences. So just do your research and stay safe out there. So you're going to want to opt for a VPN like Nord, Express or Surfshark that have large server networks, obfuscation features, and strong privacy policies. Free VPNs are way less reliable and might compromise the security. So quality options like these are the best. And to help you out, I've included full reviews of each VPN, as well as discount codes in the links in the description. So let me know which one you got and how it's working out for you. I'd love to hear your feedback. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.